about Man City because because Man City have Haaland, De Bruyne, and lot lots of good players, and they're they're more likely gonna win. City because they they're such a good team and they haven't lost against Arsenal for a long time. And I support City anyway. How come you support City when you're from here? Okay, favourite player in um, both teams. Who's your favourite player in both teams? Haaland. Uh, I'll say Gabo J. Um, Ramsdale is my favourite in Arsenal. And ha um, Kevin De Bruyne is my favourite in Man City. But I think it would it would be a draw. Draw. I think it'll be like two two or one one. Three two. Three three to Man City and two to Arsenal. City. Arsenal. Because they're better than Man City. Uh Man City is Lost uh, Kyle Walker and John Stones. They got Harlan and Kevin De Bruyne. We got Kai Havertz, Saka, and Trossard. Who's good right now? Uh, you and F. Mm, Arsenal are probably gonna win because uh, the Pep Guardiola isn't doing well, and the Man City aren't doing well. And the Harlan misses open goals. Uh, two one to Arsenal. Two one to Arsenal. Um, big game, tough game, but I feel like Arsenal will get the job done. Um, I feel like we got the the momentum coming into this game. Obviously, we've had international break. Hopefully, that doesn't slow anything down. But I do think that Arsenal are gonna. Mm, yeah, Arsenal get it done. Two one win. Two one win. Yeah, I think the same. Two one win for Arsenal. I think Arsenal are in a good place at the moment in terms of what they're doing. They get this win, and we got Luton on Wednesday, I think, or Tuesday. We got both of those wins, and eight games to go with a few points gap between Manchester City and us. It's going to get us there, I think. I think this is a very, very important game for Arsenal. I think Arteta will get them going for it, and if we get this win, I fancy us for the league. Uh, so, do you think if we win the game, we win the league? I think if we win the game tomorrow, we win the league. Um, tomorrow, um, also depends on Liverpool as well. Obviously, Liverpool are on top of City, if I'm right. Are they, are they are right, isn't it? Yeah, Liverpool are still on top of City. I think they're playing Brighton at home. Is it at home? Yeah, so yeah, so that's going to be an interesting game to look out for. So we'll see, though. I, I do think that if Arsenal do win tomorrow, then we win the league. So What's your starting front five for tomorrow? Front five um, Saka on the right, Marcinelli on the left. Um, oh, who goes up front? That's the, that's the question. Havertz up front. Let's say Havertz. He's on form. Um, and behind him, obviously, I'm going to have Declan Rice and what's that? And Martin Odo. Martin Odo. No, Gabriel. Is this? Nah. Um, he come off the bench. It's too, it's too much of an emotional game for game for him, man. Prove a, he'll, he'll, he'll try to prove a point too much. I was hoping that I can go first because I was going to say exactly the same thing that I'm sitting there thinking about it and I was thinking about it yesterday and thinking if we put Havertz up front then he's been doing bits at the moment but Jesus I just think that last 20 minutes if we need a goal at 1-1 then I think Jesus to come on and score the winner so I'm going to call it now you heard it here first on the uh, TikTok channel when we get it going again the TikTok channel is going to be a 2-1 win for Arsenal and Jesus to score the winner there you go I support Man U, but I still think City's a good team. So I might, I think they're going to win 2-1. Arsenal's got a good team. I just think City's more composed and you can't really beat Holland at striker. Alvarez is a good striking partner, so he can like set the ball up for Holland and he can just strike. I think Arsenal's going to win because they just have good finishes and they could easily score. And I think um, City is just like has overrated players. Like who? Like, like. Haaland, like uh, Foden and stuff, yeah. You sure about that? You sure about that? Yeah, okay. Uh, what do you think the score's gonna be? Huh? Score, score gonna I think Arsenal's gonna win 3-1. Uh, 
Um, Foden, Foden and Doku are depends. I think Doku is gonna take Foden's place because Doku is just like faster and like technical. I think Foden is good, but he could be better if he played like Cam because he he plays like a winger, of course, but he could, he's good at passing at crossing. So if he was a like Cam, like he could pass the ball a lot and like be the main be the main pardon. 2-1-C. Uh, Man City's winning tomorrow. Why? Because uh, we got Kevin De Bruyne or Haaland. Uh, I think Arsenal will win because the team is so good at playing out from the back and they're just brilliant at playing football. Jack Grealish running through the wing, yeah. He's going to not Meg uh, Martinelli. No, but Ben White got him covered. And Raya is going to get nutmegged. Mahu. I think the score is going to be 2-1 to Arsenal. What do you think? The score, 1-0 uh, Man City. Okay. <laughs> He's scared. <laughs> so, no. I, I think he is scared. I think he's scared. Okay. Who do I think is going to score? I think... Martinelli and Saka. Who do you think is going to score? Uh, I think uh, Haaland's going to score. Haaland? Yes, Haaland. Okay. Uh, I think Man City. Who do you think is going to win? I think Arsenal. Why? Because Arsenal, their the, the strikers are very good. They have Saka and uh, other, other players. So I think Arsenal, Arsenal will win. And you take Man City. Uh, I, I'm thinking Man City because they've got Haaland, Kevin De Bruyne, they've got Julian Alvarez and Arsenal. Last season they bottled the league the last game, so I don't think Arsenal will win. I think Man City is. Of course, I think it will be... I think it will be 2-1 or 1-0. To, to Man City. I'm thinking 3-1 to Man City.